Hi, welcome to Grade 7, Chapter 7, Part 2, um, Adding and Subtracting Fractions with Unlike Denominators. So when they're, um, when they're the same denominator, it's pretty easy, but we have to get them both to the same denominator. So we have to change both to a common denominator. So we're going to deal with two questions, one-third plus one-fourth and one-third minus one-fourth. But the numbers are the same. So we've got to find the common denominator of 3 and 4. So we're going to multiply it out. So 3, 3, 6, 9, 12, 15, 18. As we go through 4, 4, 8, 12, wait, 12, and 12. 12 show up in both of them. So we can use 12 as the common denominator. So to change this to 12, we have to multiply this by 4. Whatever we do to the, to the bottom, we do to the top equals 4 over 12. Those are like fractions. Like, yeah, they're, they're the same fraction. It's just different numbers. So to get 4, we have to multiply by 3. Whatever we do to the bottom, we do to the top, equals 3 over 12. So now we know 4, 1 third equals 4 twelfth, and 1 fourth equals 3 twelfth. So now we can add or subtract them because we have the like denominators. We leave the bottom the same, so it's over 12. And to add them, we get 7. Same with subtracting. When we leave the bottom the same, we have 12 equals 4 minus 3 is 1 twelfth. So those are in, if we put them to lowest common denominators, it's actually the same, 12 and tw 7 over 12 and 1 over 12 as well. So at home or in class or whatever, try this on your own. Make sure you get this. So pause it, do this question, and then follow along and see if you got it right. So to, to get 3 over 4, uh, we're going to find the same, we're going to find common fractions. So we're going to take 2 and we're going to take 4. And as we go 2 and 4, and all of a sudden, we have 4. It's really quick. It's really straightforward. It's right there. So 3 over 4 equals 3 over 4 because we don't change anything. 1 over 2 equals, we have to multiply by 2 on both sides, so it equals 2 over 4. So to rewrite this question, we have 3 over 4 minus 2 over 4 equals 3 minus 2 equals 1 and we keep the bottom the same, so we, it equals 1 over 4. The second question to try at home on your own is 1 half plus 2 ninths. So pause it, try this at home, and then when you come back, okay, let's, so we've got 2 and we've got 9. So when we go through, we have uh, 2, 4, 6, 8, 10, 12, 14, 16, 18. We know that 18 is divisible by 9 and 9 and 18. So we have 18 and 18. So we're going to use 18 here. I'm going to erase some of this so we have some more room. If we have to convert this to 18, so we're going to times this by 9, times this by 9. So that's 9 over 18 plus to work this one, we have to multiply it by 2, which equals 4 over 18. So when we add them up, 9 plus 4 equals 13 over 18. And again, that's lowest common denominator, 13 over 18. Um, that's adding and subtracting lowest common denominator. Thanks.